the spinning is still good. Oh, second avatar attack. Oh, I forgot my. Oh, I first did. No. <laughs> OMG, BG. What's going on, guys? Today we have a special Hasbro unboxing for you guys. This is RC Beyblade, remote controlled Beyblade. And it's just not your regular remote controller inside the box. You use your Beyblade Burst app on your Android or iOS device to actually control the Beyblade. What's special is that it comes with two different sets that you can get. One is your Valtrek set and one is your Fafnir set. The main thing that we need from this set is actually this remote controller base. So this base actually is what is needed to make this remote controllable. So it's via Bluetooth, so it's wireless connectivity right there. When you're battling against your other opponents, you can actually change up your strategy midway during the battle. So we got two of these so that we can actually do like a RC remote controller battle, like RC, ba RC Bay versus another RC Bay. So let's take a quick look here. Yeah, so this is actually just a regular Beyblade Burst energy layer. And then we got a metal piece here. I don't think this will fit into any other Beyblade, but only this uh, RC remote controller bay. And then this big driver performance tip base thing. Dude, they're always so big. Look at this thing. So, <laughs> they're always so bulky. It's so bulky because you know you got all your electronics inside so that, that way you can do your remote controller stuff. This is a phone holder. And we also got our, wow, pretty cool. This is a ripcord launcher. So that's a Valtric one. Let's unbox the other one. We got the Fafnir F3 digital control kit. And this one is a different color. So, yo, my favorite part about this whole set is that you can actually change the layer. So this is a piece that you basically need to make it RC remote controllable. Uh, you can actually fit any energy layer with this base. So that's a cool thing you can actually customize. All right, so let's put these two remote controller bays together. So we got the base of the bay. You can fit your ring on top and then the layer. So Valtrek is a right spinning base, so this clicks in right spinning. We also got the Fafnir one, so same thing. Fafnir's layer is left spinning, so it clicks to the left. So the layer is exact same as your regular traditional Beyblade Burst tops and that means you can actually customize it. You can put in like a Spice and Rec Room if you wanted to because it just fits in just like that. Okay, um, but some bays will not work. For example, Lumia L3, this design has a forged disc already embedded inside so that will not fit in here. Just, it will just it will not go in. Okay, so if you compare the two, there is just a small difference with the base of the bay. So the Fafnir one, the orange one here, you see there's more of a star pattern, whereas the Valtric one, there's a triangle, okay? So that's pretty cool, it's just a small difference, but the tip itself is the same, and you can even click it in. So the mechanics of the driver inside is controllable, uh, so I'm guessing that like you can make it kind of retract or come up depending on how you use it. And what's cool is we get these little stands, we can actually fit our phones here. So. Just open these up like that, and you can put it in your phone like that. So that way you can see what you're doing while you're battling. Okay, so we got the Beyblade Burst app opened up now. So first thing we need to do is actually to scan the bay into the digital world. So let's do that. Grab it from the layer. So this layer is special. It's the RC controlled version. There we go. See, look, look at the huge base there. So we gotta get that in our game first. So let's unlock the bay. Perfect. 100%. Burst finish. Okay, so once that's done, now you actually get the option of RC battle. So we didn't get that before. So we can tap on that. And it tells us to hold the bay until it flashes. So we press okay. Searching for RC Beyblade. Okay, connected. And now we got the bay, okay? So with this little phone stand, I'm gonna put it right here. Gonna choose our bay. Okay, it's gonna tell us to get ready, so I'm just gonna you know, make sure it's all locked up. Okay, so once we are ready, 
we're gonna press the green logo. In three, two, one. Oh, let it so right now I'm actually going counter clockwise, so that's actually messing up my bait. You can go to this angle, so you can see that it changes the way the bass spins. And we can go avatar attack and watch it do the work. <laughs> Look at that. It's doing some crazy stuff here. What's it doing? So you're gonna have to master the way you control your bay, but that's a general gist of uh, how you control the RC bay using your iPhone or your uh, Android phone or your iPod touch or iPad. Okay, so we both connected our bay. I'm using Fafnir. Alrighty, let's go. I'm gonna use right spin Valtriac. So let's battle this out. Okay, so first RC battle. Let's, let's hit do it. Go here. Three, Three two, two, one. one. Let, let it rip. Rip. They're already battling without us. Okay, spin, 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 spin let's spin, go. Spin, spin, spin. Boost, 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 boost. Left spin. Boost. I'm right spin here. Avatar attack. My turn too. Let's go. Oh Dude, no. They're just going crazy. Yeah. <laughs> what the heck? There's <laughs> so a tie? Like that's... Dude. Okay guys, so if you look at the app, <laughs> you can hear the motor still spinning. So if you go this way, you can see the power up. Well, went all the way max. So we both maxed up our boost. Dude, I think we got to battle again. Okay. That was... I was only, I was one click. Might be a little bit hard to see, but dude, that's pretty intense, there. though. Like hearing those that motor going off. These bays need to burst. Three, Three two, two, one, one go, go shoot. shoot. Okay. Three, two, two, one. Let, Let it rip. rip. Go. Speed up, speed up, speed up, speed up, speed up, Valtriac. <laughs> Let's go. go. Okay. Oh, Avatar, Avatar, Avatar. Oh, Avatar, Avatar, Avatar. Go. go, 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 go. Attack! Woo. You're losing spin. Go. You're dying, hard, yeah. you're dying, I'm you're dying. Hard. Go, 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 go. We're already maxed out my left but spin spinning boost. Is, the spinning is still good. Oh, second avatar attack. Oh, me. I forgot my... Oh, I burst it. No! <laughs> no! No! Oh, you won that one. Wow. All right, let's go again. Three, two, two one, one. Go, go shoot. shoot. Three, and then we wait again. Two, one, let it, let it rip. Let's go, speed boost, Valtriac. Oh, did you oh. see me fly out? Oh, we both flew <laughs> out. I like speed boost all the way to like my death. Dang, and that's crazy. Too much power. All right guys, so that was our test battle and unboxing of the digital control kit, our RC Beyblade Burst Tops. Man, um, it's actually pretty surprised how fun it is. And my favorite part is that you can actually customize the layer. And the way that it talks to the game is really cool. So um, I think you guys see this in stores. Definitely check it out. Uh, this is called the Digital Control Kit uh, Beyblade Burst Evolution product. Uh, that's basically it for this video. Tell us in the comments below if you want to see more battles using our RC base. Uh, and what else you want to see next. And that's it. As always, Geeks out!